Hi, what a signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Welcome to my main channel, Chelsea Love Tarot. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I really appreciate all of your love and support. In this reading, we are going to find out what's been talking about you lately and what were they saying. Today is the 25th of September, 2023. Time here in Da Nang, Vietnam is 10.42 a.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. And if this video finds you, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same sign. Now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for water signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. What's been talking about them and what have they been saying? Thanks for being here. Seven of Wands at the bottom of the deck. My apologies for the sound and noise in the background. I'm actually Move, I'm moving to another room. I moved here to this room, to this hotel just yesterday and a lot of things are wrong with this room. So the noise, the AC was leaking water, but so I'm moving to another room. That room is way, way, way better and less noisy. But thank you for your patience. Let's get your reading started, okay? So we've got the Nine of Wands right here. So this person is hurt, right? This person has been talking about you because he or she is hurt. Um, and the nine of wands can again maybe this person is a fire sign aries sagittarius leo strong aries i'm seeing here could also be a libra gemini chris a little bit cups can be any sign in the world here can indicate maybe this person could also be any fixed signs okay ace of swords right here and then we've got the nine of cups see the uh the sword feels a little bit painful right now to me okay feels a little bit painful it's like i'm hearing inflicting pain so this person could be talking about how you've inflicted pain in them or that they could be talking about you to inflict pain in you because the nine of cups is like hmm, now i'm satisfied you know now i'm happy now i'm satisfied because i said something to these people because i'm hurt so this person could be feeling hurt by you so they're saying something back to other people um, because they are hurt just to hurt you back okay because the sword is like pointing towards this person who is actually hurt so it just makes me feel that way and then we've got the queen of wands here around first again this person could be a fire sign aries sagittarius aries sagittarius leo and then the world is right here eight of wands around first so they didn't this person didn't say very nice things about you i must say okay um, they may have said that they've cut you off or you may have cut them off the world here they're done with you um, they're trying to move on they're trying to start a new chapter without you or that they could be talking about you having cut them off and that you have start your own new chapter in the six of wands here on first and that you're ignoring them could also be them saying that oh i'm ignoring earth uh, water signs i'm not talking to them anymore i'm done I'm moving forward um, and the Queen of Wands here in love first. Yeah, again, this person could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Don't really like the Queen of Wands when she's in love first. Either this person is just saying things maliciously just to hurt you or hurt your reputation, because Six of Wands can indicate that. Just to hurt you, hurt your reputation, or I think they did that because also because, you know, they could be selfish, they could also have felt a bit hurt by you so it's like i need to it's like payback time that kind of energy that i'm picking up on okay and they're actually happy to talk shit about you yeah and queen of wands of Overs can be a jealous queen as well perhaps this person could be jealous of you uh or maybe there's some sort of jealousy going on between you and this person and then we've got the four swords right here so this person has been planning about what to say about you um it seems although like it sounds a bit convincing though it's almost like they the way they tell people is as though they were definitely right and you were definitely wrong but i think 
deep down uh, it's some sort of revengeful energy that I'm picking up on and the fool here is in love first so this person has been talking stuff about you to make you look like a fool okay like you you're the loser six of ones and lovers you dropped the ball you did the wrong thing it could be them okay but you know in their mind it's the truth with ace of swords whether it's true whether whether it's true or not okay the fool in lovers also you know makes me feel like they could be saying that um that was a mistake doing something with you or it was a mistake being with you or it was a mistake connecting with you um, I'm hearing lessons they could be saying that oh now I've learned my lessons so I'm cutting water signs off I'm not talking to them anymore that's it no more I'm ignoring them but it could also go vice versa right water signs that they could be saying that they made a mistake you cut them off and now you're ignoring them and now you don't want to talk to them okay Let's just see more. Two swords in reverse at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, so this person has been saying that they've made a decision. Like, no way, no way in hell someone wants that they'll let you back into their life. Ace of Wands in reverse, I'm not interested anymore. Or vice versa, them saying that you've cut them off, seven of wands, you've told them to stay out of stay out of my life don't come in it's the ones in my verse like you don't want to accept any offer from them or you don't want to reignite anything with them and you've made a very firm decision again bear in mind it could go vice versa all right i'm gonna pull out more cards here three of swords in my verse king of pentacles in my verse six of pentacles in my verse so this person could be a Virgo Capcom Taurus as well. Six of Pentacles in my verse. So this person has been talking like this is not fair. Like uh, like as though whatever you did was not fair to them. And then the King of Pentacles here. Um, they may have been talking about how they've invested a lot of their time and energy into you. But then you hurt them instead. But again, if it's vice versa, they could be seeing that. They've hurt you, they couldn't provide you any commitment, any stability. It was kind of one-sided with Six of Pentacles in one verse. The connection wasn't equal and that they understand you for blocking them out, for telling them to stay out. Again, it could go vice versa, okay? Through the Swords in one verse, it's a healing energy, so they could be talking about Mm, no, I don't think I want to heal this connection or that they could be talking about you wouldn't want to heal this connection because you are so so done, right? There's this energy that I'm picking up on where it's like someone is saying that I'm so done either they're reiterating that to someone else saying that you said you're so done or that they themselves could be telling people like they're they are so done with you, okay? So we've got the Empress right here the empress hmm. some of you maybe this could be a mother or this could be a mother mother of your child children father of your child children it's not um it's not gender specific okay but the empress could also be you hmm. so this person could be talking to their mother as well to your mother as well because the empress is like a very motherly figure so the empress is actually the only like good card that i'm seeing here that perhaps they could be talking about and this part is just for some of you not all of you if you are the parent of their child children that both of you may share they could be talking about how you know like no matter what you you are the father or the mother of their children that's what i'm picking up on and this doesn't apply to those of you if you don't have a child children with this person hmm. and then what i'm hearing here is like oh you think they think either they think they could be talking about how you think you're better than them or that they could be talking about how they think they're better than you and that they deserve better or that you deserve better okay Again, it could go vice versa. Hmm. 
And for some of you, there's the original partner here as well. If you do know, if you're involved in a third party situation, I think the third party, whether it's the original partner or the third party, you know, the original partner is the one who originally is with the person and then the third party is the one that comes into the picture much later. Either one, whether you are the original or the third party, if you are if you're involved with a, in a third party situation, either the original partner or the third party could be talking all of this crap about you as well, okay? how maybe secrets have been revealed with the high priestess here in my verse and this part is just for some of you anyway water signs pisces cancer and scorpio this is your reading i hope you resonated in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm open for personal readings if you like the book me my information is in the description box below feel free to subscribe to my other channel it's called chelsea vlogs my travel channel and for those of you who like to be notified every time when i go live and every time when i post your videos uh, here on this channel, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. Take care and I hope to see you back here again soon. Bye.